This is the Molus X60 light from Shuntech, the smallest of all Zhuen's Molus of range of lights, the size of a credit card, I must say. It is a 60 watt bicolor and RGB light that packs a punch at an extremely portable size. <laughs> Let's check this thing out. Now let's move on to tech specs. The Molus X60 RGB light is an excellent quality professional performance light with a CRI value of 96 plus and a TLCI of 97 plus with a total peak illuminance of 2200 lux without the reflector with a color temperature range of 2700 Kelvin all the way to 6500 Kelvin. It also has RGB moods like fireworks, disco, hue loop, hue flash, pulse, police card, etc with lighting effects of SOS, paparazzi, TV, bad bulb, lightning, etc. This is Juwin's first 60 watt light with a battery grip, so no more excuses. Now you have a light on the go wherever you go. The Molus X60 is a powerful and simple light. You can use it as a fill light or you can use it as a key light. And not to mention, the use of Zy Vega app with this light is included. You can adjust all your color temperature or effects on your phone on the go. Another thing to note is that this light falls in the Zymount ecosystem, making it endless creativity possibilities using all their accessories that they sell. All right, so let's take a look what's inside the box. Uh, first of all, it comes with a nice case, very rugged, well padded for protection, your standard gray, shoeing, like black color, meat. All right, so let's open up the pouch and see what we have here. And here we have it. Oof, we have the light. This is the Molus X60 light. Uh, looks pretty cool the way they integrated this you know, clear skeleton look back and in the front, as you can see, this light is extremely tiny. Actually, let me lay it on my phone so you guys can take a look how small and tiny this light is. So this is my phone and look how much still you have to actually fill up my phone. This light is actually tiny look at this guys this is crazy this light is super tiny it's pretty cool all right so um here comes with a battery uh it's very familiar to your old standard x100 battery uh quick information i just wanted to put out there um Zhuin, uh, the other day put out an email saying that if you have the old version the x100 battery and if it's faulty um, just shoot them an email. They'll actually uh, send you a repair form so you can send out the light and get it repaired. Uh, Juin is um, pretty good with that. Um, they did apologize to everyone and they are sending out, you know, some repair units for you guys. So please contact Juin if you're having problems with the battery because a lot of people have been complaining the battery doesn't last long or they were just faulty in a few days and that was it. So they got you covered. Go check that email out and just give Juin a holler. All right, so even with the light on, there we go. So even with the battery on, look how tiny this thing is still. Is. This is crazy, this is nuts. Like it fits in the palm of my hand. This is actually a pocket palm light. I'm actually still gonna put my phone, I'm gonna lay it on my phone and you're gonna see my phone is actually still bigger than this light with the battery, which that's pretty insane, look at that. 60 watts of pure power. This thing is extremely strong. Uh, let me just turn it on just for the giggles here. And this thing is actually, whoa. And this is actually at 19% if you guys can see, very strong. I mean, you could use this as a key light, like I said. This is a key light and an RGB light. Let's turn this off, you guys know how it looks. I showed you in the beginning of the video. And yeah, so it comes basically the light, comes with the battery right here. Uh, you got your typical standard USB-C to USB-C, pretty standard, just charge your battery right here. And actually, yeah, let me just demonstrate that to you. You will charge the battery as per usual, like the old X100 battery right here. So right here, so you got a battery, you got the light, you got the charging cable, and you have your power adapter if you want to use this as a regular uh, key light or you want continuous power, you have it right here. Here's your power supply. 
and that's basically it what's in this box uh, i'm assuming this is um this is all it comes because this is a pre-production model uh the actual model comes out in march 20th so i'll um, be able to look out for that and i had this light already for a month and i just wanted to give it a try and see um, how it performs i really like it i think this light from what i've shown you guys it is pretty solid so yeah this is the molus x60 light from zuma and this is why all it comes in the box pretty nice I'm gonna show you a quick overview on how to operate the Molus X60. I won't go in depth, but I will show you the basic features. So to power it on, you have to hold the power button, then rotate your mode button, and it should power on. This is CCT mode. As you obviously can see, you can control your Kelvin value, and it goes all the way from 2700 Kelvin all the way to 6500 Kelvin. Put it back at 56. And here you can dial in your intensity if you want less or if you want brighter very simple now if you want to go to a different mode press the mode button and you now in HSI mode so as the same thing you're gonna navigate with your mode button as you turn you can either go up and down so if we go up to dim and then with your intensity button you can dial in how much intensity you want or if you want to change your hue, you can do so. You can also press it and it'll give you different values. Very simple. And the next one will be a saturation. So if you don't want it too saturated, you can do so. Also by the press of a button, you can dial in the intensity by a few turns. Very basic. Here you have your RGB mode, self-explanatory. Let's go to the next page. Here you have your effects page. This one is pretty cool. So I'm gonna go in with my dim let's go around here so you guys can see the difference so let's go up and you have h loop you got disco you have police car you have cct flash you have your lightning effect bad bulb tv etc you can press it again you have music mode so it has a microphone built in so whenever it hears music it's gonna react to the music so let's just dial in the intensity so you guys can see more or less as i talk it's gonna start getting more intense one two check check one two check one two and here's your basic menu and that's pretty much it also let me show you how it works in zy vega okay guys this is the zy vega app uh, currently right now it might look a little different to yours because this is the beta version but rest assured when the light releases it will be working in the regular version i already have it paired so let's click on the molus x60 light tap and connect and as you can see here i have my intensity value and stuff if you notice you see so you got your basic control just like how the Zyvega will work. And here you can have your color temperature, switch it to whatever you want. So you have your daytime, you have your tungsten, and you have your modeling light, lamp, fluorescent, sunlight, and your xenon. So basically presets just to get you going. You have your CCT gel. If you want to use a full CTB, you have it right there, a three quarter, a half, one quarter, one eighth, etc. which is, this is the fun part for me. You can actually have this feature right now and turn it on and you could dial it however you want but if you like me i like to use my orange colors and my cyan color pretty standard but right here you have your intensity as you can see saturation and also you can just dial it like this so basic features very easy all right guys so from a thoughts and conclusions i can honestly say that this light is very well built it is extremely powerful, very accurate. Um, as you guys can see in the other camera, I'm actually using it right now as a key light. So yes, you can use this light as a key light and a fill light. And you guys already know it's a very um, powerful RGB. And actually, let me just, um, now that I'm here, I'm just gonna um, pick a color and make this talk head look cool while we finish this video and yeah this is rgb mode as you can see it's very strong it's, it's really good this light and i'm actually super pumped with this light i really have been enjoying using this light i'm able to demonstrate this light to you guys um, um not yet have been um informed of the price but i'm assuming it's gonna be like in the 200 range but don't quote me on that it might be cheaper but whatever it is i'm gonna leave an affiliate link in the description so you guys can check it out and save some money you can save probably 10 percent off of my link and actually 
I might get a promo code for you guys to actually save even more money. So um, come back to this video and check it out so you guys can save some money on this light. This light actually to me is my favorite light so far that they have released. And yes, this is the Molus X60 light from June Tech. Uh, while we're still talking, let me just um, switch the color. So this is the RGB range, as you can see. Um, very stoked, very Blade Runner-ish, like this. You know, um, yeah, this is the Molus X60, as you can see. This is gonna be it for me. I hope you found this video useful, informative, and if you did, go out there, create, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.